Hiya, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Rosie Henshaw, and if you're new here, then welcome. It's lovely to meet you. And if you're already existing, guys, then thank you so much for coming back. I really do appreciate it. Grab yourselves a nice cup of tea and some snacks. Mine is a, um, what have I got? Blackberry tea. I forgot what I made myself then. Um, it's been a very long day. As you can see, I'm a bit windswept. We went and got the last of our Christmas gifts. Went out and about today walking, so I'm a little bit hot, a little bit flustered, and you know it's just been like the wind has been blowing in my hair. Um, so I've got a blackberry tea today, and this is in my Emma Bridgewater Christmas cookie mug. Oh, it's that, it's the reflection. I'm not gonna lie, I didn't want to scare anyone, but I saw a little something moving in the background. I thought, what is that? It's the reflection of my mug shining off. Um, so today's video is a Poundland hamper video. So I done a video a couple years ago and it was transforming items from the pound shop and turning them into expensive looking gifts. I will link that in the description box below because what I done is I picked up a few items. I think some of the gifts cost as little as two pound um, and they look really cute and you would never know they were from the pound shop. Now, obviously the pound shop hasn't changed much, so it's very similar items. So rather than remaking the same video for you guys, I will reshare it in the description box, like I say. But I wanna show you how you can make some beautiful hampers using bits from the pound shop. Now, I don't think a lot of people think that you could probably get gifts from there. They might see it as like stocking fillers and stuff, but if you put some of these items together, you can get really affordable but beautiful hamper gifts. Um, I've got loads of different ages you can get for, um, so I wanna go through and show you now. So the first gift I wanted to show you is I thought was really cute for a little girl. Um, so I'm actually gonna give this to my little niece, Lottie. Now they do such beautiful little girl bits in there and some of them are really, really reasonable. So I found this little backpack in there and it's got these little peelable nail varnishes, which is perfect for a little girl as it's not gonna be too strong. Um, a little nail file, some little nail stickers, there's like little unicorns and crowns in there. There's two glittery um, lip balms and they're like flavored, like blueberry, um, a little lip gloss. But these are all like little, little kids ones. So not bright colors and stuff comes in this lovely little backpack that I know she'll reuse and pop bits in and it's like this clear glittery look. It's really lovely with pink on it. Now this was four pound in there, but I thought this would be really cute if you pop this in a nice little bag and added it with these. Now in the hairband section, they have the most gorgeous hair clips in there um, and hairbands. Now I found this. Now this would be cute because she loves to dress up, especially in princess dresses and stuff like that. Um, so this little sparkle headband with the little uh, sequin gold crown on it, this was only a pound. And I also managed to get this little nine piece hair clip set. So it comes with this like little bunny ears clip with like tool material on it, two little glittery hair clips and some hair bands. So I thought this would be really, really cute. I'm gonna pop these in a little gift bag together. And this little gift costs six pounds. And I know that actually she will absolutely love this. So for six pounds, that's really good value. Pop this in a nice little bag and that'd be a lovely little hamper. Um, for a little girl, you know, if you've got like um, a granddaughter to get for, a daughter, anyone you've got to get for, and I just thought that was really, really sweet. A bit cack handed with it, um, so I picked that up. I also picked up um, another girly set. I'm going to go through, I said I'll do ages, but I won't. I'll go through just ones that I like straight off. <laughs> ones that are a handy here. Um, so I've just grabbed myself a basket. I always collect these from the charity shop throughout the year. I just literally go in there, pop and see if they've got any baskets. They're normally in like the garden section or the kitchenware section and you can get them really, really cheaply and then I save them for Christmas for my hampers. But you can pick them up really cheap. I did see they had like pink hampers in there for £1.50 today, which you could use. I think that's part of the Mother's Day range that they've still got in there. Um, so you can do that. But if you can get them really cheap in the charity shop for like 50p, 30p, then even better. Um, so this is one with a lid on it. Um, this one, I don't even know where I got this one from, but I just thought this would be handy. I'll just keep a little reserve down my summer house of baskets. So what I'm gonna fill this up with, this is gonna be for my sister. So my sister is always on the run. She's very, very busy. And I thought I'm gonna give her the gift of chilling out. Um, so I found this mug in there and this looks like the image of the Emma Bridgewater mug. It looks very similar in shape. So this is an Emma Bridgewater. You'll see the shapes are identical. They're tankard mugs. Um, it's got pink on the inside, really nice and sturdy. And it's got all these little hearts on them. Really, really beautiful, only a pound for this. So she can have a nice cup of tea and chill out. And also in the Pep and Co range of Pound Shop, they had these really lovely slipper socks. These are one size. They had these in various colors. These are lovely and cozy. They've got little grippy pads on the bottom of them. They had loads of slippers in there, but I thought these are really cute. They're gonna go lovely with this little mug. Um, and these were £2.50. So for £3.50, we're gonna pop them in our little hamper. 
with our little mug. And then also what I picked up was for two pound, they had this little diary planner. Um, so sometimes you kind of got to take this off because sometimes like pound shop bits make it look a bit naff. Um, the packaging isn't the greatest, but it's this little leather look diary. Um, and it's got loads of different bits in it. It's got notes and everything in it. So for two pounds, it's got a yearly view, planning overview, addresses, notes, daily view. And it's in this lovely lilac color. It's got love written on the front in silver and it looks like leather, really, really nice. Um, and when you open it, it's also got like the ribbon to keep your page in here. You could also get like nice little pens. But I know she's really busy and she does loads of different bits with Lottie and plans. So this would be really good for her. Um, so, and it's lovely colors as well. So I'll pop that in there. So when she gets a quiet moment to herself, she can write lists or, you know, like she likes to do the list when you're doing cleaning. Um, so that'd be really good as well. Now two, four pound 50. This is five pound 50 for this gift. And this is really cute. This would be lovely for a friend as well. Now you can bulk these up if you want to, but you no means do you need to. You could pop in some like little tea bags. I got some from my local garden center. I got some little tea pigs. These are a Christmas tasting one. You can pop them in there with the tea. So they've got like a nice tea. You could pop some sweets in here or hot chocolate spoons, whatever you want to do. Um, but like I say, you don't need to. And for five pound 50, you get a really gorgeous little gift. Um, so I'll pop that to the side. So like for about £11.50, I've got them two gifts. So you really don't have to spend a lot. I'm now going to show you something that it is just like I'm not going to add anything to it. But I found it today and I thought it was actually really good value. So I wanted to show you. If you've got a child, any gender, um, that you felt like you've got to get for, they have this gorgeous little, um, is it the hungry, yeah, the very hungry caterpillar by Eric Carle. They've got this three piece dinner plate set. So they've got the little plate. They've also got a little bowl and a little tumbler. This was five pound in there. Now this is great value. And actually the, the hungry caterpillar is hungry. <laughs> East London come at me and the hungry. Um, the hungry caterpillar, it's kind of like um, the kind of sets you'd get in John Lewis and places like that. It's a very classic book. Um, so for five pounds, you could wrap this up. This would be a lovely gift for any child to eat off of. And if you did want to bulk this up, you can get the hungry caterpillar book for about three pound in places like Tesco's and Asda. So you can make it like an eight pound gift and have the book with it as well. So the kids, when they're eating, it's just a really cute idea, but I thought this is really lovely. Um, and I wanted to get this for Albert. So I'm going to wrap this up for Albert. And I just thought this was a really, really lovely, bright colors, little set. So I got that as well. Now for babies, if there is someone you want to get for, for babies, they are really hard to get little babies, aren't they? Um, they've got for everything, you don't know what they've got and you, you know, they don't really need much, but a little token gift is more than enough. Well, when I saw these in the pound shop, I thought these are brilliant. So for two pound, they have a lot of pound gifts in there, like some bath toys and um, some little Tiva rings and stuff. So you can just do whatever you like. But when I saw these, they had a little lion one as well. Um, so I've got these for Albert as well. Now these are little crinkle Tiva. So when you crinkle it, it makes a little noise, which they love. It's got little Tiva's on the feet and it looks so well made and so cute. Now this was two pound. And I thought if we wrap this up with, this is just genius. So it's got two little hooks on it and you hang this off the buggy. Um, I wouldn't suggest hanging off a cot just in case you know danger with their neck. So maybe on their pram, like their buggy or something. And it's got a little teaver, a little froggy rattle on here. And it's got a little squeaky little crown on there. And I just thought this is gorgeous. They had this in other colors as well. They had like a, a pink and yellow kind of one on there, different colors. I know like you might want a more girlier one. And um, this was also two pound. So I thought if we got like a really nice little gift bag or a nice little brown paper gift bag and nice ribbons and pop them in there for four pounds, you can get a little baby, the most gorgeous little gift. Um, I didn't get gift bags. I need to get gift bags. I've got some boxes. So for like, for reference, these are from the pound shop as well. You can put some stuff in, in there, pop them in, put like some nice ribbon around them, make it look really, really pretty. Um, but a really nice gift that you can get. I'm going to pop that to the side. Now, if you know someone that absolutely loves beauty, so maybe like a teenage girl or a lady that you know would love, really love makeup. I know some guys really love makeup too and pampering. I found these and I just thought this would be a really lovely set for people that love that kind of beauty stuff. I'm gonna get my red box back actually. I'm gonna stack this up to show you. So in there they have a range called number six. Um, and they have like makeup brushes, accessories in there, some makeup. Um, now they are the most lovely colored powdered pink and they also have like some co like copper on them and rose gold. So I got a cheek blush brush 
which was really nice. The, just, the aesthetic of them is really pretty. And um, these are two pound each. So this one was two pound. I also got, oh, I've picked up two cheap ones, but they're different. <laughs> I thought I got a face, but mind you one, that one's bigger. So maybe I thought that was bronzer when I picked it up. I'm not no makeup artist, but I thought bronzer, blusher. So these were two pound each. And this one's got copper on it. Um, so I got them too, and then I also got these eyeshadow ones as well. So eyeshadow blender, and there's a little one there for like smudging underneath, and then one that blends it, and these were two pounds. So the free set of these was six pounds, and I thought these would go really, really nice with a Jess Wright set. So you know like Jess Wright from The Only Way is Essex? She's got some really beautiful bits in the pound shop, and they're all in this lovely like pink with like rose gold writing on it. Um, so there's this hyaluronic acid and pomegranate extract biodegradable plant sheet mask. So this was a pound, so with that to make it seven. They also had these really gorgeous eyelashes. Now I've seen on Instagram, so many people are raving about these eyelashes and um, they're meant to be really, really good. So if you've got a budding makeup artist, you can get these, these are only a pound, so I've got those as well. And also for one pound 50, there are so many colors of these. She has these 24 artificial nails and they come with glue. So I've got these red ones because they're like a dark wine red for Christmas. And I just thought if you whack that in a little box, so you've got your little makeup brushes. I know most teenagers would absolutely love this little set because they love makeup and bits like that. And also don't forget the pound shop have makeup like Rimmel, Maybelline, they have branded makeup in that you could pop and add this as much as you wanted to. Um, I'm just showing you don't really have to put too much in. So two, four, six, seven, eight. So this is nine pound 50 this gift. And obviously I put tissue paper and stuff at the bottom to bulk it up. You can put it in the lid, put the lid on it, or you can put some cellophane. But it's just really, really cute. It's £9.50, you can have a little beauty gift. If you really wanted to go all out and you have like a £15 budget, you can even add it to the one where there's the mug in there and the cosy slippers, or you could just put the cosy slippers in there with it. You really can mix and match the stuff, but they have some really beautiful items. I can feel myself getting really hiccupy. I have drunk so much lemonade today, which is not good. I know I shouldn't admit that because fizzy drink is so bad for you. Um, but I've just been craving lemonade lately, but it's making me really hiccupy. So I'm gonna have a little drink. Oh, I love blackberry tea. It just makes me feel wintry. It's like mulled wine but without the alcohol. Right, so the next thing I got was, so for a boy or a girl, these are ideal because do you know what? It is really hard to get children because especially in today's day and age, most children have everything or their parents try and cover what they don't have for Christmas and birthday. So it's very difficult as a gift giver or even as a parent, like I've got to the stage now where I don't really know what to get them. So I find arts and crafts is always a good way forward because it gives them something to do. It actually stops them from being on electricals and um, electronics. And it's just brilliant. And the pound shop have some fantastic pieces of crafts. You could make like a little craft hamper for someone. And it literally could be as small as a nice pack of pens and a colouring book, two pound, lovely gift, you're done. But this is the little hamper that I've made up. Um, so what I've got here is I've just got an A4 drawing pad. Um, and this has 70 sheets, it's all white paper. I also got some coloured cards. You get 35 sheets of this and there was loads of different coloured cards in this. So I know Archie absolutely loves crafting um, and he'll love sort of making cards, cutting out shapes, gluing them on, really nice. They didn't have any glue sticks, so I would have got him a glue stick as well. So I got those and I also got, so they were a pound each, but for one pound 50, they had these color changing markers, just like magic. Um, so basically they're colored markers. So what color they actually are is what the color is on the lid and it's got a special white pen with it. And once you draw over it, it changes the color to what's shown on the bottom of the pen. I loved these as a child and for £1.50 for a pack of 10, I thought they were brilliant. So that will be for £3.50. And then I also thought I would do this as well. So this is a foil art kit. They have loads of these Crayola kits in there. So basically what you do is you cut out the little foils. This is like a sticky page and you put them on and you rub them on and it ends up making the picture like a really beautiful foil picture. This was only a pound. So I thought I'd add this as well to it. It just bulks it up and makes it seem really lovely. So three, four, so that is four pound 50. And you could just tie this up, put a lovely little bow or a gift tag on the front of this, wrap it up with ribbon, maybe a nice little gift tag, wrap it up in some brown paper. And I know that any child that opens that, they would actually really love that. It's a really lovely gift. And it's like under five pounds, so like four pound 50 for that gift there. If you are looking for someone that's kind of hard to get and they're kind of between the sort of ages of, 
I don't really know. I know Archie and Alfie's age is really difficult. It's sort of like eight and nine. I know that's quite a difficult age, especially little boys, because actually they kind of want gaming stuff and it, that can be really expensive. But I know that most kids love fidget toys. So the pound shop have some amazing fidget toys, whether it be some like poppers or it will be like, you know, the, the spin it, the fidget spinners, loads of things in there, Rubik's cubes. Um, so I did pick this up for Albert. So it looks like a baby book, which it kind of is. Um, but I didn't want to buy stuff just needlessly if I don't actually need it myself. So I just wanted to show you, they do so many books in the pound shop. Now they do have Minecraft ones in there. Um, they've also got like um, gaming books. They've got like coloring books that are gaming as well. Um, and I just wanted to show you because these were a pound. So you could very easily get a book. And also for £1.50, there's this little fidget pop in there. So this is a rainbow fidget pop um, and they have loads of different designs and these actually are the branded ones as well. And kids absolutely love these little fidget pops. So for £1.50 plus a little book, or they do like annuals in there as well, which I know I always get my kids an annual. Archie and Alfie, they get the Arsenal one. Um, but up until Arch Alfie was into Arsenal, he liked the Minecraft ones. So literally for £2.50, wrap them up. I know it doesn't go because it's kind of a baby book, but I'm just showing you, for example, you could get a really cool book or a gaming book, pop it with a little fidget pop, and you can easily get this for a boy or girl of that difficult age. They always love these kind of things. And if you wanted to bulk this up, you could just add some like little retro sweeties or whatever you want. Um, but I just thought that was a really cute little idea. But I am going to wrap that up for Al Albert. And that one I might just put in Alfie's stocking, which I think is really cute. And then, lastly, I've saved the best till last, actually, because I saw this range, and I thought, this range is absolutely stunning. Like, this is gorgeous. Um, so I'm going to give this out. I might give this to my mum, actually, because I think she'll really love this, and she loves the aesthetic of stuff. So I got some of these beautiful bits from Pound Shop. Now, you'll never know these are from the Pound Shop. Now, I know you can go into places like Boots um, and even supermarkets and get gift sets and they're sometimes about eight, 10 pound. Actually, by the time you take it out of the packet, they're very, very small. They're like plastic bottles and stuff like that. They don't ever look as expensive as they um, do in the boxes. And these just look really lovely. And these are the sort of things that you would want to refill after and reuse because they're just such beautiful packaging. So they have in there this range, it's called Forest Wild and it's White Flowers Bath Soak. Now these ones were two pound each. So the bath soak was two pound um, and you get 500 mils of this and it smells gorgeous um, and it's lovely it's in this sort of like amber looking glass bottle but this is plastic um, and that's beautiful but for three pound uh, this is two pound as well this one i'll show you this one for three pound you also get white flowers the same scent so this is with white flowers sandalwood violet and musk um, and this is bath oil and this is 130 mils of this it obviously smells the same but I just have to smell it. It's got a lid on it, but it's still strong. You can still smell it through it. It's actually really beautiful. It smells really expensive. So these are two pound each. That's obviously four pound. I pop them in like a little gift box. I think these would look really nice in a little basket, to be honest. Maybe with some like little slippers and that. It's very similar to the beauty set that I set up last year. No, not last year, the year before um, in the beauty hamper. So that's four pound. Then they had these. Now this is the most gorgeous glass bottle and you can take the lid off the lid is glass as well it's so lovely and you get what is this 270 grams of the same scented white flowers but these are bath salts and these were three pound so i just thought i have to work my maths out it's terrible so for seven pound you get this lovely little set this would look nice in a basket with like shredded paper and all laid down it would look really really cute and these are the sort of things you would definitely keep for after but they also, like last minute I found this in there, right near the till, they have this little bath soap. And this is Forest Wild, and this is Winter Berry, so it's a different scent. But it comes in this lovely little, like, patterns leaf um, little box. And it also has this jute twine wrapped it up. How gorgeous is the little soap stand? It's so lovely, little bamboo soap stand. And this was £2, so I just thought, for £9 you could get the most beautiful gift. Now, you're never going to get a gift set in them kind of places that have such beautiful bottles in it. And I just thought that is just such a gorgeous little set and it smells incredible too. So I just thought that was really, really lovely. And when I saw all these bits, I just thought they're such nice gifts to give to people. And I think it costs about £38 for the whole lot. And in actual fact, that's done one, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, seven people. That's just fantastic. And um, so I wanted to show you that. I know it's been a little bit of a random video, but I wanted to show you. So I know I've not made pure hampers by wrapping them up and stuff, but I know it's so close to Christmas and I wanted to show you these and put it up straight away for you. So I do apologize about the lighting. And um, I've been Rosie Henshaw. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video, guys. Take care. See you later. Bye.